from kindergarten to sixth grade, I used to be the guy that people came to for help because I basically just slept through the class and I got A's on the test and that was, that was just me. So when I hit um, algebra in, in the seventh grade, it was just a big shocker that, oh, it's not gonna be as easy. I was seeing the test scores. So then that's when I knew he kind of needed some extra help. I was getting D's or C's and it didn't really feel um, great. About, I think, four of my friends, they have the same problem as me. They don't want to ask for help because they feel, oh, they'll be the outcast of the group. I thought that it showed weakness. He was not asking for help. When I noticed that, I would try to get his after-school coaches to volunteer to help him. That wasn't really helping much either because, again, that's limited time. It's not one-on-one. -on -one. They have other students to deal with. And so when I happened to drive past Mathnasium, oh, that's, you know, I was like, okay, let's call them. Sabir was a fun, energetic student. He came in. Um, he was a little bit more all over the place, but we were able to get him to focus. We would do a lot of practice problems. And when he saw that he was getting those right, his confidence just shot up. You know, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Yeah. All right, what does that stand for? Parentheses, exponents, multiplication, the division, adding, subtracting. Perfect. This is also equal to the square root of 15 times the square root of four. What I like about Mathematium is, is they find your weakness and they pinpoint it. So you can even like add the three to the other one? No, because they're different things. See, the radical 15 is like apples. So we have 11 apples plus three oranges. You can't add apples and oranges. They'll try to give you things to help you prosper. Like if you did um, the dominoes, you just imagine counting those dominoes. It's just test strategies and they teach you how to do them and perfect them. You get it? Yes. Cool. My test grades went from D's to C's to B's to A's in my algebra class. When you accomplish something in math, you feel, yeah, I overcame that mountain. I overcame that burden that most people couldn't come over. It, it, it's just, it's not that, it comes easy, it's that once you get it, you get that feeling. It's like the final shot of that game. I beat it, I, I accomplished it. I overcame all the odds.